Hey guys, you know here. And I know it's been a while since I posted anything. I've been actually really busy. So we're going to go over what I've been up to. And yeah, so in this video, we got a PSA submission. So these are going out at $30 a card. Uh, I wanted to send these sooner, but I was waiting for a couple cards to come in. And yeah, I was also waiting for my friend's card. So we'll see that at the end. First up, we had the shoe. So this stuff I'll try to go through quick since you've already seen it. We got the Akatsuki. So really nice card. And I was going to send it at 50, but I'm glad they lowered the price to 30 because it's going to be a lot better to send it there. So yeah, Akatsuki's going out. Hopefully that can get a 10. We got the Kirito. So Gun World Swordsman. Also, I got a new phone, so hopefully it looks better quality. I can't really tell. So, yeah, you guys can let me know. But yeah, so we got that Kirito. Just fix that. And yeah, and then we got this other one. So, getting the Holy Sword Kirito. Another pretty cool card. So, some of the buys I've been making is like Aniplex SPs. After the Bunny Girl Senpai reprint. It seems pretty clear that they're not going to reprint the old signatures for Aniplex animes. So yeah, I've been picking up some of those. We're going to send them out to get graded. And what I've been up to is um, I've been pretty heavily selling. So if you follow my eBay, you'll see that I put up a ton of auctions in the past couple weeks. So yeah, I've just been getting rid of a lot of my older stock. And I'm going to try to you know make room for all the new stuff coming in. I did get a BGS submission back, and I didn't post that because, um, yeah, I'm just not going to ever promote BGS again. <laughs> so we did get some pretty good grades, but yeah, I was just overall not very happy with the service, and uh, yeah, so I am not going to talk about Beckett ever again on this channel, so just letting you know. And yeah, oh, shout out to Big B, so I got this Titus from his giveaway, I use this TCG player giveaway to buy that, so that'll be nice for my collection. Got a couple Dark Magician Girls. Yeah, anyway, so I've just been heavily selling because as you know, in the overall market, like stocks and crypto are down huge, but for some reason cards are still doing really well. So yeah, I've just been selling off some of my stuff that I don't really care for or just don't need as bad, and I'm trying to put the money into this other market, so... That, and you know, I'm also just buying more cards. Stuff that I do see that's undervalued, but for the most part, I prefer to sell cards right now while the market's still hot. And yeah, so that's what I've been up to. If you saw that I put up some of my personal collection stuff, I did, but I put them for like a really high price because I don't actually want to sell them. So yeah, I figured I would just list them. If someone wants to give me like an astronomically high offer, I will sell them, but for now, I'll just leave them listed at a high price because I'm not that interested in selling. So yeah, but you never know what offers you're going to get, so I figured I might as well just list them and see what happens. So a lot of Dark Magician Girls here. I'm still not really like a Yu-Gi-Oh! expert, so I have no clue. They, these look pretty clean, so we'll see. And then also we got Dragon Ball Super. So these are going to be the first ones I've graded for DBS. So I don't really know what to look for, but... You know, there was no whitening, none of that, so hopefully these can get 10s. So these are like winner stamped cards. I don't know, you got them for getting top cut in one of like the finals tournaments. So there's not that many out there. And yeah, I just think they're really cool. They kind of remind me of like those Pikachu Pikachu coin trophies. Um, yeah, thought they were pretty cool. And we got the full set of those. So the Piccolo, the Vegito or whatever, and then Bergamo. So I haven't actually seen Dragon Ball Super, so <laughs> yeah, I know, but uh, these are my friend's cards as well. But yeah, I haven't seen Dragon Ball Super, but you know, I like the characters from DBZ and like the older ones. So yeah, I figured I'll send some of those. So yeah, he had that Fate Zero card, the Shioko. That's actually a really cool card. It's apparently the Haunted House version, so... That was pretty interesting to find. PSA obviously didn't have it, so I had to like manually enter it. We got this Ash Blossom. Uh, don't know what that is, but it looks really cool. I really like the foiling on like this rarity, whatever it is. Like I said, I don't know Yu-Gi-Oh that much, but <laughs> I like the cards. And we got Yuma. So really nice submission here. Very excited to send these out and get them back. So $30 tier, they're saying is like, three to four months we'll see what happens with that hopefully it can be quicker but um 
yeah, we don't really know right now since they just started doing it. But yeah, we'll hope for the best. And I'll be back soon because I do have a couple more things to post. So yeah, see ya.